Hi friends. Um, I thought we could do a quick game um, that has to do with the beach and the ocean and also is helpful for us to recognize our letters of the alphabet. So here we go. I've got, I'm going to show you what I've got here. Okay. So I have all these letters of the alphabet floating in a container and they are on fish. So the first thing I thought would be really fun is if we make the water, what color? Yes, blue. So I'm just going to drop a little bit of blue in there. Next, ooh, look at it kind of falling down. That looks pretty cool. That next I have a net. And I'm first just going to mix around the blue a little bit. Let's get that blue moving. There we go. We want it to look like the ocean, right? There it goes. Now it's looking more like the ocean. Ooh, it's beautiful. Now I thought we could scoop up some letters and identify what letters of the alphabet they are. So here we go. I'm going to start with this yellow fish right here. I'm going to scoop it up. Okay, I'm going to look in. What do I have? What letter is that? Anybody know? Yep, the letter T. Good job. I'm going to flip it out over here and I'm going to try again. Ready? Here we go. Hmm, this one looks good right here. Now I'm going to look inside. What letter is that, friends? Anybody know? Yes, the letter U. Great job. Flip it out. Got my net. Let's do some more fishing. Hmm, this one looks good way over here. Scoop up this letter. Ooh, it's on the side there. Let's see if we can move it down. Now, let me just grab it, actually. This one will just grab. And you can help me identify it. What letter is that? Yes, M. Great job. Here we go. Hmm. Which one should I pick next? This is a game you could do at home. I saw it with ping pong balls. You could write the letters of the alphabet on them and practice your letters or anything that might float in water. Let's see what this one is. Are you ready? I'm going to just take it right on out of my net and we're going to guess what it is. What letter is that? Good R. Great job. Okay, let's see here. I'm going to go over here, I think. This one looks good. Hmm. What letter of the alphabet is that, friends? Anybody know? Yes, it's a P. Good job. And I just flip it over here. And then we keep going. Let's see how many we can get. Here we go. Scooping up another one. Scoop. Now let's see if we can recognize this letter. Who knows that one? Yes, A. Good job, friends. Wonderful. We still got a lot left. Let's do this one over here. Just that one. Okay. What letter is that, friends? Which one's that? Yes, K. Good job, the letter K. Let's keep going, we'll do a few more. Hmm, I like this one over here. That fish just swimming in the ocean. Here we go. What's this letter, friends? What's that letter? Yes, L. Great job, L, the letter L, like lion. Ready? Um, let's do this one. Look 
Can you see that one? What letter is that? C for what? C -c cat. Ready for another one? Let's try way over here in this corner. Hmm. Can you see this one? Let me pull it out so that the lighting is good for you. What's that letter? Anybody know? D. 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 Dog. Right? Good job. Let's do two more. Here we go. Let's try which one. Can you see that? Let me scoop it out with my hand. Scoop it on out. Here we go. What letter is that? Anybody know? J for Jack, right? Last one. Oh, I'm gonna do this one because I'll tell you why in a minute. Anybody know what that letter is? It's E for, what starts with E? My name does, Emily and Elephant start with E, right? You could play this at home and try to get all the letters and identify all of the letters of the alphabet, okay? It's lots of fun, all right? That was fun, friends. You might need a net or some kind of a scooper. You could use a, a, stra a strainer from the kitchen or a big, huge spoon called a ladle and you can try to identify all the letters of the alphabet. I bet you can do it, okay? Look at this big, beautiful bush in the yard. I love when it blooms. Okay, see you soon, friends. Miss you all. Enjoy this nice, sunny day. Bye.